All right, so we made it to the top of the hill. Jake's gonna fill up his water bladder. We'll start walking around looking for some milk. See if we can't get lucky. Feels like it's 80 degrees up here. Jake grew a Santa Claus beer. Uh, I gotta blend in with my people, the squatches. All right, so our goal, try and make that ridge over there. Take the flyest part, Jake says. Why is that? Because we just got here and you don't want to do that. We're becoming middle aged men. No, we're not. Not even close. Well, I think these are like deer and elk beds, but it's probably a cow. That's more, <laughs> that's more like a cow. <laughs> if you find a rub, then we're in good shape. But What do you think? First elk rub. There's these little It's like a rattlesnake. So Jake's scared. See? See that? That oh, chicken shit. Quick little break. Jake hasn't seen any elk, but he's eaten half of the jerky bag. Sasquatch is hungry. Sasquatch is hungry. Look at all the cows. There's more cows than elk, that's for sure. My cow tag classifies one of these. Yeah, you get a little more meat. The cow tag. Cow. Shooter's choice, Jake. That one. I don't know, that was a good cow right there. Saw one elk, one cow elk, plenty of deer, plenty of cows, plenty of bucks. Second day, elk hunting. Made it back to a different spot. No idea where we are. We don't have a map. We just followed a trail until we could pull off and start walking. Our truck is huh? Unless your memory's that good. The truck's right over there. Oh. We've only walked 100 feet. Okay. I ain't marking it. Quit watching OnlyFans. <laughs> Jake and I have devised a strategic plan here. If we don't see any elk today, I'm gonna start hunting deer tomorrow. That way we start seeing elk. Cause all we've been seeing is deer and no elk. We're trying to flip the odds. Well, then the cow chimes in. <laughs> I just don't want it to be a, a hunter. Oh well. So Jake and I have been hearing bugles. We're just trying to figure out if it's another hunter or another elk. So we've been on this ridge here, walking this old cow path. And just over that ridge, or so we think, we've been hearing a, a 
bull bugle. Now we don't know if it's a bull or if it's another hunter, but we think it's worth going to take a look. Jake set it in, in high gear right now, so keep going and see if we can't see something or find something. Wrong kind of cow. We found a deer skull and hung it up there in the tree. Jake's gonna mark it so when and if we come back, we can come visit our totem, correct? What are we doing, Jake? Scouting. All right, day three, passed a group of cows on the way in here. We're gonna walk up to where we were yesterday and see if we can't find a bull and pull in some cows. Wish us luck. We've been walking this ridge of this mountain here where we saw those herd of elk yesterday. I haven't seen anything, haven't heard anything after trying to bugle. <laughs> this is a poor attempt. <laughs> Keep trucking. Yeah. Right. We'll find some. Yeah, 
pretty good. All right, heading down back to the truck. Full day of bugling, failing at bugles. Saw, what was he, three bulls? Yeah. Three bulls. Um, initially, we got up to this one range that we wanted to hunt. Thought it might be good elk territory. Getting to this real thick, short, pine, cedar looking stuff. And uh, yeah, sure enough, there's like a dozen, dozen cows. They saw us and spooked and that's kind of been the end of our day, but at least we're seeing them. At least we're seeing them. Let's go see if we can kill things today. <laughs> Is it day four? Day four. Super dead this morning. Done a couple bugles. Tried a few cow calls. Trying to find some new places to go. We didn't bring any toilet paper. So what are we gonna do? Find the log that's nice and smooth and wipe it. Probably what we're gonna have to do. No. Well, first game we see this morning is a doe 20 yards away. Sasquatch here. Didn't see it. Tree was in the way. Tree was in the way. I saw it plain today. But, oh well. Wasn't the first time, won't be the last. We're just sitting here admiring our boots. I just might have duct tape around them. And Jake's are pretty much brand new. No, we got a hole there. He's got a hole. Oh, he's got a hole on the left side of his boot. I might have to tape it. Oh, man. We haven't seen jack shit today. Other than the doe Jake scared. So our plan is to walk a ridiculous amount all the way around to this watering hole. Maybe something will happen, maybe something won't. <laughs> yeah, so Jake and I, we're sitting by this water hole, hoping for a deer, because we saw three deer there earlier this morning. And off in the distance, a coyote starts yelping. Scares this bull down right to where we are. Had a pretty, pretty close encounter. Unfortunately, he doesn't have any cows with him. 
But that's how it goes. Jake's still messing with him. No, I think he's done. <laughs> Crazy. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? Not sure yet. No call. That's, that's not a call. But I'd try. Sasquatch is watching. He's walking through the forest. Catch a glimpse of him. Is it? Oh, he's hiding. He's hiding behind that tree. Look. Oh, there he is. There he is. Anyway, Jake and I came up this ridge. We liked the looks of it. Um, nice and open. But there's just no sign of elk or deer or anything up here. There's no food up here. So, I'll have to give it another shot somewhere else. <sighs> Yesterday we didn't see much. Except for that bowl, which is pretty sweet. But we're both getting a little antsy. We want something to come home with. So, see if we can't get her done. Well, Jake finally found something worth finding. Nice little five point shed there. He's gonna make it into a uh, keychain holder. Hanging on my keys. Yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah. Can't put them in your pocket anymore, but. No, but I can. Oh, <laughs> yeah. there you go. Self defense. Yeah. Oh no. Jake doesn't like to be on camera. Small little bull. Little spiker coming right to us. He's gonna come say hi. Saw some sound, he didn't even know. Yeah. Here, Jake and I are trying to catch up to a herd of elk that we had uh, run into, and we're just trying to formulate a plan.
I'm disgusted. Find a group of cows with a bull. And we decided to stalk it for two miles. Two miles. Right as, right before we get to where the herd's gonna be, so we can actually see what we're hunting. There's a little thicket in front of us, and we're both about, what, 20 yards apart? You and I? Yeah. More or less. And then this damn doe comes walking out of this freaking thicket. I knock an arrow, draw my bow back, put my 30 yard pin on her. Didn't have time to range it. At least I thought I didn't. And what happened, Jake? Fuck! Shit! We missed. Yeah, that's how it goes. There's a lot of does in there, though. Well, after that blown hunt, it's a long, somber walk Three back to the travel. Yeah, we ain't taking the, the woods, we're taking the trail. Forget that. Alright guys, we struck out again, another day, a whole lot of nothing, we were on elk all day though, that's where we found the other, found the same herd that we spooked earlier, got on them, tracked them for a little bit, they're just too fast, <sighs> had a few more encounters with a couple more bulls, Better that. bull tag. Watch out for that big ass rock on the side of the trail. Can we take it home? No. <laughs> I'll throw it in my pack and carry it around. There you go. Well, we got half a day tomorrow. We'll try and get something. Well, we got lucky. I don't know if we're too lucky yet, but we found a little buck near the trail. We got a shot on him. But it's a gut shot, and there's a pretty tough to track. There's some more crap. Well, we've tracked him quite a ways. See white bellies? Blood. Blood. Well, we found him. Cut his belly open. Yep. That's one way to kill a deer. Man, I ain't gonna lose any meat. Well, he's already found him. He's not very big, but he's done. He's a small buck. He gave us an opportunity. I missed on my opportunity earlier. Wasn't necessarily a gut shot. He's just low. Got him right behind the brisket. So. Takes my little pack mule. Carrying all the meat. There you go. <laughs> we got her done. We got a tag too. I'm happy. Coming home with some meat. It feels pretty good. We didn't get an elk yet. We'll try tomorrow. We'll see what happens. Sweet. Alright, final day. Last day to make it happen. Half a day. Heard a bunch of bugles. Where we were yesterday. Been in here. How full is it? 23. I think he's got a herd of cows with him. Only one view going anyway. But I don't know how you want to approach this. I don't feel any wind. They're going to hear it's coming. It's a little bit coming. It's coming from the downside. Going downhill. To our benefit. Yeah. Okay, okay that one 
one's off to the left. Okay, he's he's a ways away yet. I'm thinking it's the same bull from yesterday. Trying to round up his cows. do gosh it didn't seem like when we got up to that brush it didn't seem like they were in that much of a hurry but I heard the bowl I haven't heard he's right at the bottom I haven't heard him since plus he's not talking back I just don't know what happened there I don't think we bumped him I really don't we had the window out there but God, they just ghosted us. Yeah, up and over. We got 60 yards from that one. And if he wasn't pushing them so hard, because I don't think the cows really wanted to leave. Crazy. Morning pellets. Yep. All kinds of them. Well, we ran into this group a couple more times and just too thick to see anything. You could smell them and hear them, but just couldn't locate them. So I think we'll, if we don't see anything on the way back, this one's in the bag.